It's finally out. Welcome to the new episode of The Walking Dead. This is the third episode called A Long Road Ahead. It's been over a month since the, uh, the previous episode and I'm really excited about this one. A lot have happened in the previous one. Those brothers were evil. Their farm was a slaughterhouse. And food is not our problem anymore. Here you can see my stats from the pre previous episode. As I said, the food isn't our problem now. We ended up stealing food from that car. Clementine wasn't happy about it, but we are hungry, so we need to survive. But I'm sure we'll <laughs> bump in more trouble. Okay, let's play. Previously on The Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! Kenny! What the fuck? Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Okay, in episode 3, starting now. I'm pretty worried about that woman. She said something about Clementine. She was she was taking photos or video. I'm not sure. Looks like this is our lucky day. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. Yeah, well, the less I see, the happier I am. I'm not sure. Where is this? Made up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon. I bet you're in the let's stay put camp considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. Hmm. We should go. We should go. The motel's run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. Oh my god, looks like a bomb fell in here. Okay, just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. It's like a war zone. Ain't much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <laughs> Shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. <laughs> Okay, let me see how... Oh yeah. <laughs> I forgot to play. There's no safe way through that mess. 
forgot com commands. Hmm. <laughs> Let's push it. Grab that. Lily's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Yeah, yeah. He just he just threw a brick on his head. Come on. Yeah, should do the trick. Okay, let's back. Get back here. Start no. Start the car. Hmm. Ah. Use. Oh. The girl's still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon. I haven't asked. You even talk to that girl anymore? Here's my way up. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. No, he won't. Wrap his hand. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Oh, shit! You idiot! Jesus, are you okay? No, Dick, I'm shot. Now get off here. What, walkers? Help me! Oh my god. What is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. Shoot. It's a girl. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. Oh my god. Fuck. We gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Can't. Think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Yeah, I think he's right. No. What should I do? Oh God. Fuck, man! You're not hitting anything. Oh God. I can. What? What? I didn't choose. Good. Let's go. She'll keep busy. No, come on. I didn't want to leave her. I tried to fire, but I can't believe I missed it five times in a row. Gosh, I'm so sorry. We should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Okay, let's find everything. Oh, he's fast. <laughs> he's I don't know if I have time. Clear everything, maybe. What? Uh -huh. Come on, what? She's gone. There's not much time now. Oh yeah. I have a limited time. 
Come on, come on, come on. As much as I can. Um, come on, take it, take it, take it. I think that's everything. That oh, there's a walker. Nothing, over. What? We're still clear. Let's hustle. Oh shit! Shit! Come on, come on! Q, 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 Q. He's gonna leave me? What? Fridge. What fridge? Oh. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Shit. Shot him. Shoot him. Shoot the fucking bastard. Damn it. I don't know if you can hear that faking noise. <laughs> Buttons. What if you do, that? I'm sorry. They're everywhere. You took care of yourself, didn't you? Come on, come on. back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone and come and rape our women and children. So, what did you get? A lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. Because piling into an RV with you after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? Calm you know, down. I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. We have to go eventually, Lily. I know, Lee. I know. Eventually is different. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions. The strongest the together. And I don't think you're capable any- We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, mm. not just things. What about medicine? What about medicine? Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I I'll got lucky nature. and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? It was a mistake. We got our supplies, but we should have tried to save her or put her out of her misery. Well, you had Kenny with you, so some options were off the table. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers, and the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth, and it's coming this way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? 
I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out. Whoa, what's wrong with her? Somebody's stealing? Huh? She's right, you know. Shit's just getting worse by the day. Whatever, Lee. You've picked your size. Ken, that's not fair. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Damn idiot. Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Oh, I get it. I was supposed to kill her, not the walkers. To put her out of her misery. Yeah. That's why I missed. <laughs> but uh, that's enough for this first video. I hope you liked it. I know I did. It's amazing. It's gonna it's gonna be pretty hard this episode. There's a lot of stuff going on here. I'm sure I can handle it. But till the next time, guys. See ya.